Hey everybody, welcome back. It's Iowa, November, and the sun is shining and 50 degrees out here today, and we could not pass up this opportunity to come out and play some radio. So here we are. My good friend Leon up in uh, New Hampshire, Kilo Charlie 1, Lima, Bravo, Lima, sent me a sketch of a 20 meter inverted V dipole that is a wavelength and a half in size. And it intrigued me because in his sketch, it shows the current lobe at the highest point at the very peak of the mast. And uh, I thought, well, that's pretty, uh, pretty smart to put your radiating efficiency right as high as you can possibly get it. So we're going to be building this thing and see actually how well it works. We're going to really put it to the test, though. We're going to be operating one watt QRP. We're going to do some one watt whisper tests and kind of see what kind of the radiation pattern is and see how far we can get out there. And we're gonna try and make some contacts as well. So without further ado, I won't bore you anymore with talking. So let's go have some fun, come on. So just to show you quick kind of what the, how the antenna is gonna work. This is a 450 ohm ladder line that we're gonna use. And I've got it uh, split, at, this will be split at the top for my two legs. And I'm using the, uh, uh, BNO Tech Go. It's a uh, 22 gauge wire. So on the spider beam, I just uh, got it electrical taped to the tip here, and uh, we'll get it launched up in the air. Ugh. I'll tape this up as I go. We got her set up. We got the uh, 40 foot spider beam launched and we got the uh, ladder line tied to it up there. We've got one leg off to the west, 48 foot leg, and it's tied off with a string about right in there. And then the string goes down to the post and the other one pacing east, the east leg, another 48 feet down to a string and tied off. Here's the west leg. Got our little uh, electric fence plastic stake there going up on a pink string up there a little ways and then it hits the wire and goes up the rest of the way. Spider beam's doing a pretty good job of holding everything straight and square there today. Just a quick layout here. We got the ladder line coming down feeding into the MTech ZM2 uh, tuner matching unit here on the balanced ladder line, uh, balance outputs here with the coax going to the uh, FX4 CR radio. So we're going to actually operate uh, one watt today. Power is going to be one watt. Yeah, Roger, thank you. Kilo Zero, Kilo Lima Bravo. You're 5959, over. Okay, Kilo Zero, Kilo Lima Bravo. Good to hear you again. Uh, you're only about 5 to 5 in Virginia today, Jeff. Oh, smooth, I got Kilo Zero, Kilo Lima Bravo. Got you about a 5 by 5, 5 by 5 into Kilo 5515. Kilo Zero, Kilo Lima Bravo. QSL, Kevin? QSL, QSL, you're 5757, Iowa. QRP, one watt, over. Oh, you're running one watt. Good deal, good deal. Got you 53, 53, part Kilo 104, South Carolina. QSL, Kevin? Okay, we've got 10 seconds left before we do a one watt whisper test. Here we go. Five, four, three... And the results are in of our one watt whisper test. We had a total of 96 spots, 96 stations heard us. Uh, looks like we got some Hawaii and Alaska and a nice, uh, omnidirectional spread around the United States. And we got some DX over here into Europe as well. Some stations over there heard us. So all in all, uh, performed pretty well, I would say. 
Kilo Zero, Kilo Lima Bravo. Kilo Zero, Kilo Lima Bravo, five by seven. Your five seven Iowa one watt dipole over. Dan, you're booming in with your one watt. Sounding great in South Dakota. Have fun. Iowa. Check in, check in. W4, WSB, Bill, Northwest Georgia, YL System, Weekend Warrior. Kilo Zero, Kilo Lima, Bravo. Kilo Zero, Kilo Lima, Bravo, QSL. Roger, Roger, you're uh, 5757, running uh, 500 milliwatts QRP, over. Kevin, come back to me out of Iowa. Roger, Roger. You're 5757, over. Uh, very light copy. Give me a Roger, Roger, bro, uh, Kevin. Roger, 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 Roger. Hi, you came up that time. How you doing there in Hampton? I'm doing great. We're running a half a watt QRP on a dipole, over. <laughs> okay. That answers a lot. A half a watt. Uh, let's see. Do I put that in as a half or a point five? My goodness, uh, uh, you got a light copy and you come back to me. Let me give you an exact copy. Okay, Roger, Roger, K0KLB, you're 57 Iowa, over. Five in the northwest Georgia, Golf Alpha. Goodness, Kevin, I get you down in QRP. Anything we can do for you? Well, there we have it. The 20 meter, one and one half wavelength inverted V dipole up 40 feet performed pretty well. Uh, we operated one watt QRP and did a whisper test, made some contacts, and uh, made some good contacts with some pretty good signal reports. And uh, we turned it down to a half a watt on that one call to Georgia, and he was able to pull me out there as well. So all in all, I'm pretty impressed with this antenna. It might even be worthy of the home QTH on a permanent basis, so we'll have to see about that. So thanks, Leon, for the suggestion and the sketch. And thanks everybody for stopping by. We'll say 7-3.